What's up guys? This is Coach Donnie with ElevateYourself.org. In this video, we'll learn how to spike with proper footwork as a left-handed attacker. So don't worry, I have not forgotten about all of you left-handed volleyball fans. If you're looking for a great place to buy volleyball gear and equipment, All Volleyball is my favorite place to shop. Get 5% off your entire purchase when you use my discount code and purchase link in the description box below. First, we'll start with footwork. Start your approach at least outside of the court and behind the 10 foot line. If you're a taller player, then you should start further back. And if you're a shorter player, then you should start closer to the 10 foot line. I recommend starting with a three step approach and then later adding one more step if you want to develop a four step approach for more hitting power. For a three step approach, start with your right foot back and arms at your side. The order of your steps should be right, left, right. The length of your steps should be medium, long, short. The rhythm of your steps should be slow to fast, where your last two steps are very quick and smooth. Use your arms to generate extra momentum by swinging them forward on the first step back on the second step, and then up on the third step. If you want to develop a four step approach, start with your left foot back, and then start the approach by stepping first with your left foot, then perform the three step approach immediately after. So the order of your steps will be left, right, left, right. Also, make sure that you start further back compared to a three-step approach since you're taking more steps. Now we'll talk about body positioning. When you're spiking on the right side, make sure that your first step is always toward a good set. Then, turn your feet on the last two steps so you are facing the setter. Your body should be facing 90 degrees relative to the net so you can rotate back into the court with more power and greater range. spiking on the left side, make sure that your first step is always toward a good set, and then your last two steps will be pointed toward the net, which is a different body positioning compared to the right side spiking. Make sure that your right foot ends up in front of your left foot. Your body should be facing the net so that your chest is mostly parallel to it. This allows for the same benefit as opening up 90 degrees on the right side, where you are facing the majority of the court and can rotate back into the court with more power and range. Juros Kovacevic is one of the top outside hitters in the world who is left-handed and plays for the Serbian men's national team. He has very efficient and consistent spiking footwork, which is a big part of his success. 
I want. Kovacevic again, finding a hole. Will give the medical staff a little bit of time to patch up Eric. 23. Easy serve. Yuris Kovacevic with a kill off the left. A little bit squirrely sometimes. The angles are different, but you, you just really have to concentrate. Really have a year to finish his degree. Good high flat shot. Yuros smart. Yuros Kovacevic was just like. What a perfect pass. All kinds of choices. And Kovacevic once again. Kavika Shoji, the brother of Eric Shoji, the libero, is going to come on now at the setting position. Tiana Boscovic is one of the top opposite hitters in the world who is also left handed and plays for the Serbian women's national team. She is also the hardest female hitter in the world right now and spikes these crazy angles because she opens up really well and is able to generate a lot of power based on her body rotation and torque. what you were talking about, Ofesovic sent it to the other side. The defense, there's no block in sight. Nobody was ready for what has been. She doesn't care, she just attacks. Ah! Her body language, just give it to me. Just give it to me, I'll take care of all these women. She's an abandonment, that's so hard to discuss. 10-12 is a tally here. The attack. That's a great observation. So the key to being an effective left-handed spiker is to live in Serbia and to be Serbian. Just kidding. I just think that it's ironic that two of the top left-handed spikers in the world are from Serbia. Please share this video with all of your volleyball friends, teammates, and coaches who would like to learn left-handed spiking footwork. Don't forget to subscribe to the Elevate Yourself YouTube channel for more volleyball tutorial and tip videos, volleyball highlight videos, and jump training videos. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.